What do you mean Justin Bieber canceled the rest of his world tour? That's right, sorry, believers. Oh baby, let's get into this story. I'm so excited about that intro. Thought of so many Justin Bieber songs. Here's what's <laughs> going on, okay? So uh, yesterday, this was the statement that Justin Bieber's team released. Due to unforeseen circumstances, Justin Bieber will cancel the remainder of the Purpose World Tour concerts. Justin loves his fans and hates to disappoint them. He thanks his fans for the incredible experience of the Purpose World Tour over last 18 months. He is grateful and honored to have shared that experience with his cast and crew for over 150 successful shows across six continents during this run. However, after careful consideration, he has decided he will not be performing any further dates. Tickets will be re be refunded at point of purchase. Now, something worth noting is that Justin Bieber has been on the road to promote the Purpose Tour and promote the Purpose album. It's a part of the Purpose Tour. So much purpose here. <laughs> uh, it's hard to say that on purpose. Uh, Justin Bieber has been on the road since March of 2016, and he was scheduled to be on the road until mid-October. He had about upwards of 150 shows left. Mm -hmm. So this is he had a lot. He had a lot. He still had a, to come, a big chunk left, and he had come so far. I think yeah. I've forgotten how long he'd been on exactly. tour for. And also uh, the tour. Is, it was very lucrative. It raked in around, I think, 90 million, according to Complex, in the first half of 2017 alone. So it was a very successful tour, but it was it was all encompassing. It was a huge thing. It was, yeah, it was and I, it sounds like we're not getting a, anything from Justin himself. I think he's been active on Instagram, but I don't think he's released a statement as of mm -hmm. this taping. So we'll see if he says something. Do you feel as though Darren he needs to come out and say something, or is this team like is this statement from his team sufficient that they've said this is right? Canceling it, unforeseen circumstances. You guys are all being refunded. Right. Let's call it even. You know, I feel like with him, there's kind of a pass where on tour he kind of gets in a little bit of trouble. Um, I was watching a show last night uh, where it said kind of the things that he's gotten into. I guess when he was in Colombia touring, he he spray painted a weed leaf on a wall. He had a pet monkey, and when he left Germany, he just left the monkey at the airport. But wasn't that years ago? This is the whole. It was years beams. ago, but Justin Bieber, he's still so young, and I yeah. feel like immature. Um, and just because of his past, I feel like it's important, you know, for his fans who have been loyal to him throughout mm -hmm. all these things, you know, to let him know that it's it's not, you know, it's not because of anything crazy. He just ah, you know. so you think maybe he should come out and say, look, I know that in the past I have had some sort of crazy yeah, things go down. Issues. It's not that I just need some time. I'm exhausted. Exactly. This tour has been so long mm -hmm. and it's so draining. I mean, to to put all that out there, right? And this is what I will say. A, a couple friends of mine, uh, Sarah Spad, mm -hmm. went to go see Justin in concert and she was very excited to go see him and I asked her about how the show was and she said the show is amazing. She went to go see the Purpose Tour when it was in Los Angeles. She said the show was amazing mm -hmm. and it's it, the music is great. Obviously this album is, is people are saying this is his best yet, right. one of the best albums of 2016. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, well, how was Justin? And she's like, you know, like, I mean, he's doing it. Like he's yeah. doing it. He And there's some songs where he, you can tell kind of, is invested more than others, right. but what we forget is that looking over his tour schedule and like what was planned as of yet to come and what mm -hmm. had all he had already been doing and a press tour before the album right. even released, that is exhausting. Now, is it also his job? Yeah, like yeah. should you do that to the best of your ability? Absolutely. Was this perhaps maybe biting off a little bit more yeah, than you could definitely. chew? I think there's also that too, because then you look at the bottom line dollar where people are looking, they're gonna make so much money right. yeah. off of this tour. Mm -hmm. So many people are profiting off of Justin Bieber, and at some point in time, once he's sort of made his money, promoted his album, promoted this music, it's done well, it's got mm -hmm. the reception that he wanted, I can kind of understand that you reach this point of being so tired and wondering, do I need to do the rest of this? Yeah. It's not like you guys haven't heard the songs before. Exactly, and I feel like if that is the case, his fans would understand. I mean, he has such a massive, like, cult loyal, following, loyal they literally following. wouldn't care. Yeah. Uh, but I mean, I think it's really important for him to come out and be like, you guys, like, just you know. to clarify what's yeah, going on. Yeah, I mean, I mean, do you remember that concert where it was, he was singing and like the crowd wouldn't shut up? So he's like, "Okay, I'm leaving," and he'd like drop the mic and left. So he's just had he's had a few things where it's like, "All right, you know, we want to know that you're okay." Yeah, I think that's like, what it is. If you're exhausted, please let us know. This, but another yeah. interesting fact about this was that he got banned from China, China like mm -hmm. a couple days before. Mm -hmm. So that's also an interesting tidbit. <laughs> there's yeah, there's a lot going on here. I think ultimately, if you are a believer, you want to just make sure that he's okay. It's a little strange that you would cancel 
cancel this tour. And if you are not a believer, then well, he's not going to be coming to your city if he was <laughs> planning on doing it. So I guess it's kind of a, a, a win win for no, that's not how that expression works. It's, no. a, it's a win win. Hey, Justin, we want to make sure you're okay, but we also want to hear from you guys in the comment section below. Are you a believer? Are you not a believer? Do you not care at all about this story? Please, we'll be sure to check out those comments when you let us know in the comment section below. This was a weird outro. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. It's early on a Tuesday morning, and we will see you next time on <laughs> Pop Trigger.